So after having previously drilled this cylinder very successfully on both sides, um, I'm just going to look to snap it. See how easy that is. So I just stuck it in a different vice. So obviously in the door you wouldn't have the luxury of probably giving it quite as much welly, but that has just snapped beyond the anti-snap. That is a complete failure as far as I'm concerned. And it should have snapped ideally there first, then there, but that's just... So that was quite surprising that that snapped so easily. Admittedly, it put quite a lot of torque on there, but uh, still snapped relatively easily. So, let's zoom in a bit. And there's a little magnet in here. Pull that out. I think that's a magnet anyway. And there's the firing pin. See that? I can actually push that down. So if we can push that low enough. That cam, in theory, should rotate, but doing them both at the same time is actually pretty tricky, not going to lie. Uh, let's just try and push it down now. Uh, I'm just rotating the cam. Doesn't want any of that. So I'm going to stick it in the other vise and we'll try and drill out, drill out that pin. That firing pin is the bit that's going to stop us from manipulating the cam from this side of the door. However, there's a way around that I've found. So you can see there I nearly pierced the back end of the case. And what I was actually trying to do, I was actually trying to pierce this case in order to get to that firing pin. So basically you can drill all the way through the lock to the firing pin at the back and effectively even take out that firing pin from the front of the door, which if I need to, I'll demonstrate in a second. just chewing through the last little bit of that and I didn't realize it's actually an age ago but uh, there we go so there's the firing pin the firing pin's actually really long but managed to just drill the bottom of it the rest of the firing pins falling down into a housing and then bang your door is open so whack anti-snap or whack drilling the firing pin I'll be honest was the hardest thing to drill that was it um, i did use two drill bits just getting through that last little bit but that's mostly because that uh that pin is very big and it just it wore me down pretty quick <laughs> 